morning family welcome back to your channel once again today is monday today is the day after my beautiful wonderful road trip and visit with the dear sweet hannah honey where i had an amazing time if you have not checked out either one of our vlogs i'm gonna need you to do so before you watch this video okay I'll leave both links down below just so you can check them out. We had a great time together, y'all. And now let me explain. So, because <laughs> some of y'all, bruh, <laughs> some of y'all, let me sip this coffee. Mm. Ooh, yeah. Okay. Some of y'all had me dying, as y'all always do in them freaking comments. Because some of y'all talking about sharing. I see bags in the back seat. Like, I know you got them pillows. I know you got this. You alive. You say you ain't gonna buy nothing. And I know, listen, let me explain y'all. Seriously, straight up and down, left to the right. I wasn't intending on, like, going to buy something. Hannah convinced me. <laughs> Hannah made me do it. She made me do that. Okay? Got to clear my own name. <laughs> Just kidding. I, I really didn't mean to go, like, in there and, like, do no damage. Like, for real, I wasn't going to do that. But I knew if I saw what I had been looking for, I knew if I saw it, I was going to get it. Now, I'm going to share with you what I got, and I made a stop when I left, when me and Hannah parted ways, because I didn't want, I didn't want to feel like I was keeping Hannah from her husband, and her family, and stuff, and all that, or whatever, so, I made a stop when me and her parted ways, like, I just GPS a store, honey, and I went in there, and then I came on home, so I'll do what I got from Z Gallery first, and then I'll show you what else I got, I don't even know, like, what start with so they give you these bags big enough to freaking get inside of so this is the first bag this is my first purchase from z gallery ever first time ever going in the store experiencing that was with hannah and it was that store is legit it's beautiful it's beautiful it's a very inspiring store they are expensive they got some expensive stuff in that store, and if, you know, you want to buy it, it's there for the taking. And if not, you can definitely find a dupe somewhere else. But if you like what you like, hey, you know? So, first thing, and as soon as I seen these, I stopped in my tracks. I told Hannah, oh my God, yep, yes indeed, yes indeed. Y'all, we had the best time ever so this is what and i didn't do as much damage as y'all probably think i did at all honey nope 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 but y'all know i have been on the hunt for a very plain but really really nice quality lantern this sucker is really really nice i don't let me see if the price is on here wait a minute now they had a 20 percent off um when we were there yesterday. Okay, hold up, y'all. Approximately five feet tall, weighing 125 pounds. Hold up, y'all. She has long black hair. Brown eyes and braces. For expedition out of South Carolina. Blue shirt with flowers and blue jeans. Amber alert. The abductor is described as an unknown male with a yellow bandana around his face. Oh my God. They were last seen traveling on a town road in Lumberton in a green 2002 Ford Expedition. South Carolina registration. NWF. Somebody. This is an amber alert that just came across. The screen of a Hispanic 13-year-old girl wearing braces out of 
South Carolina last seen in a Ford Green Expedition. She's wearing a blue shirt with flowers and blue jeans. Okay, sorry y'all. I don't play about them Amber Alerts. So I got this um, right here, and it was hey, is the price on here? Regular price was ninety nine dollars and ninety five cents with twenty percent off of that. And I totally have been wanting one. And I knew when I saw it, um, I, I was gonna know it. Now, Home Goods typically, I would, like the the big ones that I got outside. I've had other ones before and got rid of them or whatever, but Home Goods usually have them like this. This is just a plain freaking lantern. Not just a silver top, plain, nothing at all going on with it whatsoever. I couldn't find them in Home Goods. Pier 1 didn't have any plain ones, just plain. They all had like something going on or whatever. Or either they were wood and, you know. So I really, really wanted one that was just plain because I'm going to do something with it have an idea. So, I got that. And from Z Gallery. Okay. Oh, God. You can call this the glass hall. <laughs> this is a baby. Then I gotta rewrap this stuff to, um, for my mood. Girl! Okay, y'all, wait a minute. Wait a minute, hold up. <laughs> this one is not going to fit in the frame. I'm going to tell you that right now. Here's the other one. Okay. Oh. This one was... $129.95 with 20% off. And that is how that one looks. You know, I wanted two. I wanted a really big one and then a smaller one. To do something with and so as plain as they are they're exactly what i was looking for and again like i said normally my favorite stores would have these all day long even uh burlington coat factory no luck whatsoever finding just a plain glass see-through okay so let me put that there because if my plan were you'll get to see it what i want to do with it all right, let me keep this paper because I'm going to reroute that to pack up. I'm probably going to haul that in my car when it's in my mood, y'all. Okay, so also from Azita Gallery, this is the other bag, the other body bag right here <laughs> that they gave me. Um, I got, because... First of all, I'm shopping right now for the sunroom. That's my whole plan. It's the sunroom, okay? I want the sun... Man, my whole apartment is girly because it's just me. You know what I mean? I don't have that special guy to consider how he feel about pink and girly stuff. So, my whole apartment is girly. But I want that sunroom to be extra, extra special because... I opted out not to get, you know, an outside area, like to actually walk, excuse me, outside. So, which I'm totally cool with. Like, I'm totally fine with not being able to walk out on a patio. You know what I mean? Totally fine with that. So, I want that space, since I can see out, though, to be the pro probably the glamest room in the entire house, actually. I want it to be the glamest room in the entire house. Like, that's my little sitting area. That's probably where I would spend all of my time at. So, it won't be the office. It'll just literally be like an extension of my living room, but just like my little cozy girl nest. So, that's what I'm shopping for. Okay? I needed to clarify that as well. And Matea's calling me, trying to interrupt my video, but I'm not letting him. I'm not letting him know it. He wanting to come get all the stuff off the patio that I'm giving him here. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, first of all, I know. Come on, camera. Stop freaking playing. Like, stop playing so that they can see this beautiful, beautifulness here. Now, this wasn't expensive at all, you guys. This was just um, 
85. This is about the going rate. It was still cheaper than even that little small one that I used to have on the buffet from Pier 1. That thing was a hundred and something dollars. This is so pretty and sparkly and just really nice and heavy. And it's just silvery and glittery. And yes, you can totally find one at Ross or somewhere similar to it. But this particular one just gives me the vibe I'm going for. You can totally find a dupe for that. Um, also, from the last season of gallery is... I got three of those flowers. Those big, huge flowers. These were $15 a flower. And they're big. I'm not going to take them out because they are easily dirtied up. But they're so big and fluffy. And they came in this color and the gray. And they're going to go in this uh, vase right here. Just, you only need three because look how big they are. Look how much circumference they cover. Just three of them. You know? As opposed to like the bunches we normally do. So I'm going to put them in this vase right here. And that is all I got from Z Gallery. Now those pillows y'all saw me renting and raving over. I couldn't, I could not y'all justify. I couldn't do it as much. And I, and you know, I tell you, I pick and choose what I want to spend my money on. Like ridiculous amounts of money. I really will pick and choose <coughs> what I want to spend my money on. But I would need four of those pillows, and I just can't see $400 worth of pillows just for a couch. I wouldn't want no, see, I don't want to be that person where you can't touch my pillows. Like, I don't want to become her. Those pillows would have made me become that person. Like, nope, don't touch that. No, uh-uh, I don't, don't want to do that. So, I could, I just couldn't justify $95, even with 20% off. Now, if they ever drop down to sell around the $50 mark, I'd get four of them. Just so you know. So, like I said, Z Gallery, even if it's not your cup of tea, you don't, you know, your money ain't funny. I mean, your money is funny, and it's like, huh, I'm not going in there. Cause I don't blame you, okay? I don't blame you, not one bit, because, again, you can't find great dupes. And I have, throughout my entire apartment, from all of our favorite stores that are way, way cheaper. You are truly playing for the Z Gallery name. And the crazy part is nobody knows that these even came from Z Gallery. I just showed them to you because, you know, I went to Z Gallery. But there's nothing on these that say Z Gallery. And I totally could have found these if they had I had them at probably Home Goods, which is where I typically buy my lanterns from, for way cheaper. I could have gotten two probably for what I paid for the one. Okay? So you're definitely paying for... This bag right here. When you go to the gallery. Bag. They do have some unique stuff. I ain't taking nothing away from them. I probably will visit it again, you know. Oh! Okay, wait a minute. I'm filming. Hold on. I'm going to say it to death door. <laughs> Hold on, y'all. Wait. Okay, sorry about that. He scared the bejeebus out of me, honey. Standing at that door, I just saw a man. I'm like, okay. I guess he figured, you ain't calling. I'm coming to get my stuff. He said I can have it. <laughs> so he's getting, he ain't want everything. He just wanted a couple of things off the patio. So weird. Okay, so anyway, I told you, if nothing else, going into Z Gallery will give you inspiration, okay? So when Hannah and I were in there, I zoomed across something that to I totally saw something different when I saw it that inspired this what I'm about to share with you right now. I even think she may have zoomed past it as she was filming too. And I didn't say nothing. I was just thinking to myself, mm -hmm. I didn't even walk over to it to see how much it costs. I just said, boom, red light. I got an idea. Okay. So that's what all this right here is about to be about. And when I was getting it, so on my way back, this is from Home Goods. I stopped at Home Goods in Durham, North Carolina. Durham, on my way back. And when I was in there, 
I'm gonna have to rewrap those better anyway. So that's fine. There was a lady and she said, if you don't mind me asking, <laughs> what you plan on doing with all of that? Like is it for the holidays or something like that? And I said, no, it's not. But uh, I told her what I was gonna do with it and she thought, well, I wouldn't have never thought of that. Like, that is a good idea. So I said, look, join my channel on Sharon. She's so fabulous on YouTube and you can see exactly how it turns out. In my mind, I can see it clear as day. All inspired from something I saw in Z Gallery. And I was like, I, I don't even know what it costs. I don't care. I'm just going to do my own. And we buy these every day. So, okay. This is this is an apothecary jar, okay? So, look at this. Look at the base on that, how thick that is. This thing was only $14.99. Okay? So, you have that one. Here's the other one. It's like a big old wine glass. Girl. What that's honey, when you drink a wine drink wine out of glass this big, you got some serious problems going on in your life, honey. You need more than Jesus. <laughs> so this was $19.99. I like the shape of this, the stem on it. Of course, you know I needed it to be height difference. And then I got this smaller one. Looks like a little fish bowl and a smaller version of problems. Okay. This one was only why was this one $19.99? Sure, it's smaller than that one. I think they priced that wrong. Okay, so that's those. Let me show you the lids on. Look how big this lid is, you guys. How big and thick that is. I think this one on there. So, oh my God. Yes, I already, the vision, the vision, Lord, the vision. The vision is real, okay? Here's the other one. And I think this one goes on there. Let's see. And then, that's why I say, you guys, even if you don't purchase anything, DIYing and getting inspiration from all these places is a great way. Okay, yeah. All right, so... Now, you see those there, right? Three different size apothecary jars. When you see these apothecary jars again, they will not look like that. Okay? Total DIY is about to take place. Simple DIY, because I like, I like over the top, but I also like simple where simple needs to be sometimes. You know what I mean? And these... Three pieces together is a statement. Right now, you can't really see the vision because it's just like clear glass all right there together. You can't really, you know, you can't really see what I see. But once I get done with them, you guys, yeah. So I got those, like I said, home goods or whatever in Durham and got lost. I got lost coming back from there. Um, so also from Home Goods, I got again, keep in mind, I'm these right here are there's two different places in my mind that I'm thinking of putting these when they're done, and I won't know exactly which place until I've completed them and got the look that I want for them. Then I'll know exactly where they're gonna go. But again, keep in mind, I'm really, really decorating for my girly girl sunroom. So I grabbed, and I don't know if this is going to work. I'm just hoping that it is, <laughs> to be honest with you. So let me move these because we will see together. Okay. All right, so I got this, which is an everyday thing. You you guys know that. Z Gallery do carry some with the little bling on them. Ross, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Home Goods. Like, I got these. You can find them anywhere all the time. And they just have, even in the wine glass, 
uh, like a real drinking wine glass. This is like the actual um, candle holder. So this was, of course, $16.99 because of this. I bought these things so many times, so many colors over the years, and especially since I've been doing YouTube. So I got a smaller one, and it has double the bling on it, and it's just the little candle holder votives, okay? I want to put this tall one in there, okay? I'm looking now, I don't think this one is going to work because I didn't realize how small this right here was. It could possibly work, but we'll see here in a second. So I got those, and then I got, and if it don't work in there, that's fine because I could totally get a small one because they come in three different heights, you know that all. And I just got two simple, plain white candle pillars, plain, no smell whatsoever, to go on top there. Okay? I just wanted it to just be nice and plain, not doing nothing. I wanted the simplicity, but the look of this. like so just like that let's see if I bring them closer can you see the difference I didn't want a whole lot going on at all I just wanted that is so elegant seamless classic classy to me oh my god I just love just simple so simple and just so woo, yes okay Again, this is for my sunroom area. Um, that vase. Oh, okay, let me keep going. All right, and the last thing I got from Home Goods, and then I am done, you guys, with this haul, is two of these. Now, I have been watching these. My Home Goods have had one. Every time I've looked, they either had just one or they were smaller, like. Like more of a desk size. And then I found the two there. So I've been watching these. I see them all the time. But either they're too small or it's just the one. And it's just this pear-shaped, blinged out, simple lamp. Doing the most, but not really. Okay. White drum shade. This was $59.99. And of course, they had me two of them. And what was crazy is I was about to give up because they only had the one on the shelf. So I'm like, as always, it never fails. They only had one, just one. And I just happened to, you know, walk around down some more aisles. And there I saw this one. It wasn't even on the lamp aisle. It was over there with the furniture. This, I guess somebody had sat it to, you know, see how it looked on some furniture or whatever. And that's where I saw it. And I ran back and got this one. Whole time praying, please let them be mates because I can't remember what the other one looked like. So they just look like these. Um, look at that sparkle. Ooh. This is for the sunroom. For the little tables that I'm going to put out there. And it's not a really big sunroom at all. It's literally not that big. It's just a little extension. It's the, like, the size of a patio. So you know a patio is not really, part of a patio is not that big at all. It's just the size of what a patio would have been open, except it's closed. That's it. So, there's not a lot of space out there at all. So, my plan is to put um, two chairs, my two, the two gray chairs that I got from the at-home store. Um, one on each end, a little small table, and these lamps on each table. And in front of the window area, I wanted a very long, skinny console. Very thin, like very narrow and thin, just to put some decor on. And to, like, it's kind of like, um, I just don't like that dead space. I don't like the dead space in front of the window. I feel like it's calling for a very slender... Um, console. 
very thin, very slender, not doing a whole lot, not too tall. I need it to be, you know, because I, I want to be able to see out the window and pass the decor that I'm going to put, put on it. So, I thought if I found exactly what it is I'm looking for, that this single vase right here would be beautiful just to sit right in the center with those white flowers and, you know, maybe, maybe oh my God. Maybe something else really low, okay? On I could see it in my brain. And then these two right here sitting at the corner of the console. Right there together. Like how, and just, that's it. A little rug. That's it. Those mirrors that I had over here, those octagon-shaped mirrors will be out there because there's no wall, remember? like I have here to put them on. So I'm going to put one at one end and one at the other end. So those mirrors will be out there. The mirrors, the mirrors, chair, table. So it's not a lot of space to work with, but it's enough to cozy it up. So someone could be on that end. I could be on that end and maybe like a little ottoman, not an ottoman, like a little footstool, you know, just a little, I could see it y'all just follow my vision. You know, y'all probably thinking, what? You just have to follow this. So, that's all I have. I didn't do no damage in Z Gallery, as you can see. Um, But, I, I, look, I wanted those pillows, y'all, but I just couldn't justify doing it. As hard as I work, and I could totally treat myself to them, the thought of spending $400 for four pillows. That I don't know how long the pink blush phase is going to last for me, for real, for real, because I like to switch things out quite a bit. Right now, I'm loving it. And it is a very calming, super girly, not too much of a color and feel. So, it might be around for a while. And then, too, I don't know. You know, I, you just never know with me. So, just to, just to think about spending $400. It's like, oh. And I've been thinking about them pillows, y'all. I'm telling y'all. I drove back thinking about them. I woke up this morning thinking about them. It's like, Sharon, no, like, I know you want to, girl. I know you want to. I know your other self is telling your other self, shut up. I'm going to get them. You don't tell me what to do. You ain't the boss of me. <laughs> well, I'm not. I just can't do it. No way. No way, Jose. And I'm starting to think now that I found these lamps, finally, because I've been looking for these lamps, y'all. And then I tell you, they have been around forever. I have seen other people haul them. I I just had no luck in my store with finding two of this size at the same time. And it's like, you know, so that area is going to be really, really girly. And that's all I had to show y'all. I got to pack all this stuff up now. Uh -uh. And, um, yeah. So, hope you enjoyed the haul. Hope you go check out the vlog that Hannah and I both did. She got one angle. I got a different angle. We had a wonderful time. We will definitely be doing it again. Again, if any other YouTube creators are in the area or are willing to drive there, Hannah and I would like to put something together to give back to you guys, our family members that follow and support us on our channels by doing something very special for you guys. You know how they have the uh, the uh, VidCon and the um, stuff for the makeup girls stuff, all that? I never see anything for the girls who are into home interior decorating and lifestyle type of videos. I never see those types of gatherings or maybe I've missed them. I don't know. But I was just thinking, Hannah and I, that would be, like, really, really cool to, like, get together and, like, put something really nice together for those of you that support us and tune in like you're doing right now. My people. You are my people. Oh, okay? why? Your girl's here for the long haul, no matter what. Just saying. Okay, you guys. So, I'm excited about all my finds, everything. I'm happy with everything that I got. Um... Them flowers is doing the most, honey. They're doing the most. They were worth $15 a piece to me. They just were. Now, to each zone. Again, when you see these, um, they don't look like that. I'm just saying. 
It will not be looking like that. But anyway, I'll catch you guys in another video real, real soon. I've held long enough. Hug some kisses. Mm -hmm. Everyone stay blessed. Stay positive. Stay prayed up. Don't let nobody dictate y'all mood, family. Do something good for yourself. And what? Always do something good for somebody else. And my trucking people, I will see you guys on the truck probably tomorrow. Because it's Tuesday and I'll be back at it again. Until next time, everyone stay blessed and just... You know, hang in there, keep your head up. The countdown is on for your girl, though. So, I'm sitting amongst boxes. Ain't nothing really behind me, but hey, it is what it is.